children, look at the picture and tell me, what is this? It is a washing machine. What is the use of a washing machine? To wash the clothes, isn't it? Now, tell me, what is this one? It is a juicer. What is the use of a juicer? To make fruit juice. Next, this is a? Yes. It is iron. And what is the use of iron? It is used to iron our clothes. Now, look at these pictures. What are the name and use of these? These are clock and school bus. The clock shows us time. And the school bus picks and drops us from school to home. Or home to school. These all are called machines. Machines are things we use in everyday life to do different types of work. Machines make our work easy. Similarly, a computer is also a machine. Let us learn more about machines today. By the end of this chapter, you will learn about human-made and natural objects, computer, a machine, and its characteristics, and types of computers. Look at the picture, you will see a lot of things. Some things are found in nature, like the sun, birds, stones, and trees. These are called natural things. Some things are made by humans, such as, table, chair, toys, and house. These are called human-made things. Machines are created by humans. They are used to do different types of work. They make our work easy, and help save time. Let us see some examples. A car is used to move from one place to another. It is a machine used outside the house. A refrigerator keeps the food and drinks cool. It is a machine used inside the house. A washing machine is used to wash and dry clothes. It is used inside the house. An air conditioner keeps a room cool. It is used inside the house. A mobile phone is used to talk to friends and family. It is used inside and outside the house. A camera is used to click photographs and make videos. Machines like television and iron work on electricity. Machines like car and aeroplane work on fuel. Machines like CISO and tricycle use our energy to work. And machines like mobile phones and calculator work on battery. Similarly, a computer is also a machine. It runs on electricity and helps us do our work quicker. It has different parts to achieve different types of tasks. All these parts work together to make the computer system function. Monitor, CPU, keyboard, and mouse are the main parts. Whereas speakers, microphones, and printers are additional parts. Characteristics of computer Do you know why the computer is called a smart machine? It is because It works faster than you do. It never gets tired. And, it does not make mistakes. Types of computers Computers come in different sizes. They can be big, medium, or small in size. Desktop computer 
a computer that you place on the desk, is called a desktop computer. It is also known as PC, that is, personal computer. A desktop computer is heavy. It is difficult to carry from one place to another. It works on electricity. Laptop A laptop is a computer that you can place on your lap. It is small in size and light in weight. You can carry it from one place to another. It works on battery. Tablet A tablet is a small computer. It works on battery. It looks like a textbook. It is light in weight. You can carry it easily from one place to another. It has a touch screen. You can work on the tablet by touching the screen with your finger. A smartphone. A smartphone is a mobile phone. It also works on battery. It has a camera that helps you click photographs. You can make calls, send messages, play games, read stories, watch cartoons, listen to music, and do various other things on smartphone. Recap We see two types of things around us, natural and human-made. Natural things are found in nature. Human-made things are made by humans. A computer is a smart machine. A computer works fast without getting bored and tired. A computer gives correct answers and stores a lot of information. The types of computers are, desktop, laptop, tablet and smartphone. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe my channel, and do not forget, to hit the bell icon to stay updated. Your comments and suggestions are valuable to us.